I think there's going to be a gradual drift higher. I think it's a combination of supply and demand. On the supply side, this is the first time ever we've seen two straight years of complete destruction of capital expenditure to create more supply. And of course, rig counts in this country are down almost 75 percent over the last two years. So there's been a lot of supply disruption. That's not a going to crank back up quickly. I think also the overall sense of this economy, it is improving. We are using more energy. And I think there's some green shoots worldwide, which suggests particularly in Asia, they're starting to use more energy. So I think the path of re least resistance is going to be slightly higher in the oil patch. And that's a positive sign. And what's the trade then? Do you buy oil or do you buy energy, energy stocks, energy equities, David? Uh, well, you know, we like the large integrated energy companies. And the reason is we really don't know where that commodity is going. And the Exxons and Chevrons of the world, they're going to make money no matter what because, A, <laughs> you know, they're integrated. So they're making money upstream, downstream. They're all over the place and they can squeeze the little guys if the going gets tough again in the energy patch.